Hello, Mr. Ford. I am Carl Bench. I was born on November the 25th, 1844 in Karlsruhe, Baden, Germany into the family of Josephine Valent and Johann George Benz. When I was only two years old, my dad died in a railway accident. Hi, I am Henry Ford. I was born on July 30, 1863 in Greenfield Township, Michigan into the family of William and Mary Ford. We lived in Dearborn, Michigan. I got educated in a one-room school. I'm sorry about you, but my also mom died in 1876. I'm sorry. My mom and I were really close to living in poverty, but my mom still tried to give everything into my education. I then went to the local school of grammar. When I was nine years old, I attended the Lyceum. After that I went to the Polytechnical University. When I was 16, I went to Detroit to work as an apprentice machinist. I then worked as an engineer for the Edison Illuminating Company. Over that period, I got married to Clara Bryant in 1888, and had one kid. I got promoted to chief engineer which gave me the opportunity to work on my experiment, the car. Good. I followed my dad's work and became an engineer. I then went to the University of Karlsruhe for mechanical engineering at 15, and graduated in four years. I didn't have good working experiences like you, but I joined August Ritter in making the iron foundry and mechanical workshop. I married Bertha Ringer in 1872, and got five children. Wow! At 15! My experiment was a success because I could drive around town in my self-propelled vehicle, the quadricycle. I then made a second vehicle, and the capital of Detroit lumber baron William H. Murphy founded the Detroit Automobile Company after quitting the Edison Illuminating Company. I tried to make a gas two-stroke engine with the company. I quit, and founded the Benz and Company Rainus Gasmotum Fabric. We made static gas engines. With the good company, I could keep on making cars. I named it the Benz Patent Motor Wagen in 1886. The quality of our company's products were not 100% so it fell apart in 1901. I made a 26 horsepower car, and people formed the Henry Ford Company. I then got the backup of Alexander Y. Malcolmson, a Detroit area coal dealer, and made a partnership called the Ford and Malcolmson. Limited which would make cars. I actually created the first car that could make its own power which you made 10 years later. I then made two more models which had improvements. I sold it to the public. I had more victories. My death was in April the 4th, 1929. Bye, Ford. Bye. We asked people to invest in our company because business was low. We got back in business. I then trained people to make an assembly line. We made thousands of Model Ts. Bye. We both made the same products but at different times. We both made the same products but at different times.